So what else we got? Spear bonus combo. I might want to hold off on some of those. Oh well, this one's this one's easy. Leave none behind. Done and doneer. Let's go wreck some fools. Go go Darunia. Let's see. The eggbot should be playable. The eggbot is playable, but you have to beat the game and do a bunch of bonus stuff. You have to find parts or something to make him actually playable, which is a bit of a shame because, like, I'd like to play him sooner. But at the same time, did I? Did I call him Darunia? I probably did. Bleh. Now I can't remember his actual name. Uh, it's not Dodongo. That's the other one. Try get that. That Durbadap. Durbadanga Durga. Daruk. There we go. I just, Darunia is such a good name, but they already used it for Ocarina of Time. Incoming! That should do it! Okay. So, what do you need? Oh. I won! There we go. Goodbye. It's over. Oh yeah, nothing to it. I get the distinctish feeling that these aren't actually. Oh wait, no, that is. There are Hylian ca captains in here. I thought this was going to be a big bamboozle. Please clap. Who on this? The big jet. Bye, Marvin. Ah, oh, shit, this Rito captain's in a bad spot. this guy? Thank you. And then can I spank him into next Tuesday? Excuse me, sir. I don't know what I was supposed to stop him with, but bombs work! Oh yeah, nothing to it. Do they have anything good? I don't know. I think I automatically pick up stuff, so I don't really have to go out of my way for this. But I will anyway. We it's where they got longer. But I could be wrong. I won. Incoming. Got this. I'm getting really good at this flurry rush business. Bye. Oh shit! There's another one. Bombs. There we go. Gosh. Like, I remember absolutely adoring Dynasty Warriors as a kid. And I realize a lot of this just has to do with the tech allowing you to chain combos like a crazy person, plus all the bombs and tablet powers and whatnot. But like, this is just miles above what they've ever made before. Look at me go. Probably actually mess with some weapons here, because I'm probably running out. Oh, we got a new hairstyle for Lunk. All right.
<sighs> it's going to be hard for me to go back to any other Musou games after this. But if we're lucky, they'll figure out exactly why this game was so much better than all the other ones and take that into account. Okay, what else we got? Young girl from Rito Village wants to make a flowery garland for a local goddess statue, but can't find the type of bloom she needs. <sighs> oh, the green flashes means I've got a material there. Got it. The Rito girl's face lit up when she saw the rare flower Link brought for her. Even the goddess statue seemed to have a faint smile dancing on her lips. Link will have so much health. A fly-by-night operation. After much clamoring from the warriors who use the flight range, Rav Ravioli has agreed to add a night course. Find some glow-in-the-dark stuff that could be applied to the targets. This will do. The flight range targets, coated with paint derived from luminous stones, glowed brightly in the night. Staff soon had a flurry of applications coming in for the night course. Well, we might as well do this one. Daily Drills Rito. Beat the snot out of a bunch of Rito? Can do! Where have I been going today? Oh shit, it's almost 10. I'm having a good time. I said I might play Demon Souls tonight. I think that was a damn dirty lie. <laughs> Uh, I'm having an absolute blast, though. This game is... Gosh. Like, I liked Godfall. Godfall was pretty good. Spider-Man I haven't played properly yet. Bug Bug Snacks was shockingly good. Pathless was shockingly good. I... I'll have to compare, like, launch seasons and launch w windows and some other stuff. But, like, this might honestly be one of the better fall seasons for, like, great new games. Because we still haven't, like, we, we're not done yet. Because we've still got uh, Cyberpunk 2077, which could go either way. Uh, we've still got Haven. Oh, yeah. Nothing to it. We've still got... There's at least, like two or three more really rad looking games that are coming out over the next couple of uh Got this. It's over. Yeah. I wonder. over the next couple of weeks. Nice going. Stop, stop smacking me around. For for you having fun to frustrated like you are in Demon Souls. Oh yeah. The thing is like with Demon Souls, I'm actually still having fun, but you are you are right. There's something just so much more childishly enjoyable about this. Oh, it's Ravioli again. Round two, jerk. Ow. Might as well just smack him around a bit. Well, I didn't have my tablet abilities anyway. It's over. The one-man army feeling is magnificent. Yup. It is actually really kind of difficult fighting Rivali here. Because I can't see what he's doing. 
I do tons of damage when I can get to him, but... Unfortunately, the volley himself is, uh... A bit distance. I wonder. He's so close. Hey, I actually managed to get the finger rush there. Let's just zap him again. Because yeah, unfortunately, ranged characters hard to avoid. Bomb. Coming. Incoming. There we go. That's the hit. Why does he have so much health? Because boss slash mid boss. Why is Rivali nice to Daruk? I guess he's just. He can respect the man's absolute girth. Probably go check weapons. I think I'm just gonna finish off a bunch of side side missions that we've got here, and then maybe we'll dive uh, dive in more tomorrow. A yeah, season warrior respect kind of thing. Yeah. Whereas Link is kind of more of an upstart in Ravioli's eyes. Okay. Do you wanna? Yeah, let's do, let's do some training camp. Let's get everybody up to level 20 at least. Hey. <laughs> Whoops. Hey. Oh. Oh. Let's Yo. do some blacksmithing. Zelda. I haven't exactly used you yet. Now, she's got an ancient memory part. I think they're all just ancient memory parts. Or I consumed her original weapon. Well. But this one actually does less damage. Okay. <laughs> I guess that'll just have to do. Uh, Mifa. Special attack charge rate, which I think is fine. So we're looking for square. Two. Oh, interesting. Okay. So it doesn't look like you can double up on these abilities. Okay, so in that case, let's... Let's just grab a bunch of these that aren't terribly useful. Oh, not that one. There we go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you can double up on the same trait. Okay. You're right. That could be really cool with the perfect dodge. Like, we're really going to have to build for that later, though. Okay, so now Mi now Mifa is actually properly equipped. Let's take a look at you. So... Ooh, battlefield-specific material drop rate. Let's... Let's see if we can do the same thing on this one. <laughs> oh, shoot. I screwed that up. I wanted to get it so that it was uh, double, doubled up on the battlefield specific material drop. You know what? It's fine. Uh, let's see. 
select this, combo on that one. We might be able to get another. Okay, luckily these are cheap. There we go. So she's actually got probably the best farming weapon that I have. Okay. So now we can do... Yeah, now we can do this one for sure. Let's actually... Let's actually use input again and see if I can remember how she works. I think it was pretty easy. I think it was just a matter of building the runes with combo attacks and then triggering them properly. The first weapon selected when fusing will give their first skill. Okay. I mean, I think my current methodology works fine enough for the most part. We're just going to have to wait. Until I've actually collected more. But I'm assuming later game weapons are going to have even better traits. I, I can't imagine that all weapons are made equal in this game. I mean, we've already seen a little bit of damage variance. But I, I bet there's, like, higher tiers. Okay, I remember how she works again. Steal yourself. I am ready. It's time. It's time. Okay. I forgot how, like, goofy strong her bomb was. Okay. Yep, no. Impa is still goofy strong. You feel about more bombs! There we go. I feel like it's a lot easier to get her symbols out in this one. It's over. Finally ready. It's time. Next. Witness. Wow. It's time. Is it even worth using anything other than just mashing X? I'm sure it is. Absorb symbols. Looks like you can also get multiple symbols with one hit, too. She is OP. I mean, most of the characters are OP. You just kind of either know how to use them. Or, uh, got to figure it out. She doesn't actually have the highest damage potential out of all of them. She just has such wide range. That it doesn't matter. I am ready. It's time. Next. It's over. Okay. It's time. Bam. He was just like a living grind box. Now. Of damage. Half the time limit remains, apparently. Steal yourself. Okay. I am ready. It's time. <laughs> I should kill a whole bunch of them. Hell yeah. That was quick. Okay. 
Oh, we've actually got two of these Hylian captains. Okay, maybe she's actually really good. I don't know. I mean, we knew we knew Impa was nuts with the whole like just bunch of shadow clones murder people. I think I still like Daruk better, but like, there's no denying how ridiculously strong having a bunch of crazy clones just wrecking shit is. But I just... I... I will continue to give them good props, major props, for making every character just ridiculously fun. Okay. To take down the monsters skulking around their town, the villagers of Kakariko Village must be able to fight as one. Make preparations for the feast that will strengthen the villagers' bonds. Oh, can I can I turn this one in? Nope. It's telling me about it. I am stronger than before. After a filling meal of carrots harvested from local farms, the villagers' bonds were much deeper. Impa joined them for an early morning tra for early morning training and was awed by their cooperation. So now she's got Another Y move. Still can't do this one. Ah, uh, but that's just HP. And that's Lonk. Mifa bonus combo, hell yeah. Mifa's added swimming to her daily training regimen. She didn't already have that? Even for Azora, she's a first-rate rate swimmer. But she wishes to refine her technique even further by studying how fish traverse the currents. All the better to help my friends. Watching the fish dart nimbly through the water. Nimbly? Mifa had an epiphany about how to refine her own form. She will now be able to fight more effectively in water as well as on land. But mainly just mash Y more. An irresistible aroma. The Goron warriors, feeling weary from long days of training, are hankering for some tasty rock roast cooked to a nice golden brown. Why not help them out with some fire starting supplies? I can feel the power! The Irresistible aroma of prime rock roast attracted many hungry Gorons, as well as the well-cooked meal was polished off in the blink of an eye. No longer fatigued, they can now fight at will. My meat man is even meatier than before. Okay, still can't do that one. So it looks like to... oh, well I guess we still have Zelda's training. And to get this one... oh, right, right, we'll have to go to the cold areas and eh, later all right zelda's training restricted allies time limited let's see if i remember how to play Zelda. <laughs> i'll be fine it'd be fun to see linkle in this game it would be i unfortunately she is not i'd love to see her as a dlc character with like a, a little mini plot about linkle but honestly even more than that i would love to see legend or legend of zelda i'd love to see nintendo actually you know, use her as a proper character for a, like, a standalone game. You want to see the Korok King as DLC? Uh, you mean Hestu? The one with the maracas? Because, like, Hestu's in this game. You play as, you, pl you can play as Hestu. We're getting there. Yeah, the big broccoli dude with the maracas. Yeah, I think Hestu is like one of the next characters we unlock. I can help. I succeeded. If I must, now this. I. I'm not going to lie. Now this. Off with you. Zelda's combat style, like, of every character in this game, Zelda's combat style 
feels like button mashing. The wild part is, it's incredibly effective. It's just, there's no finesse. It's just, go wild, press buttons. Okay, XX this. That gets the bomb that I can just set off. Okay, wrong one. Okay, so that one swings it around. X, X, X. Okay, so she has, like, no combos. I think that's one of the big issues. Uh, what the, all the enemies. Here, here we go. Hello, goons! Like, there's no denying her effectiveness, but it's such a weird, awkward character. Let's see, Believe Zelda can get a bow later on. That's probably for the best. I like her Sheikah tablet fighting techniques, but it's very much like... Hit button. Hope, hope for best. And like, don't get me wrong. Works great. Mostly in close range. I even have Impa as a helper on this one. That just feels... It feels like they knew the Zelda herself, as she currently is, is just kind of goofy. I don't know if I've used this move. <laughs> Did I just take a photo of them and it exploded them? Is that... That happened. I can see why the king is kind of disappointed in her progress. He's like, stop! Just get off your phone! Zelda's like, but father, my phone is the only thing that loves me! Hang out with the bomb bot. Oh! <laughs> just smacked him with a metal box a bunch. Okay, now. And smacked him with a magnet. It's like... I get it. I understand it. It's very hard for me to immediately respect this in the same way. I was really hoping he'd throw his weapon. Oh, but he... Hit him with everything, again! <laughs> Boop! I see! It's just... It's so dumb! <laughs> and on one hand, I love it, on the other hand, it's just like... Man! Her style is just wildly different from everybody else's. Okay, what else do we got? I'm gonna have to play more of this tomorrow. We might honestly just play a shit ton of Hyrule Warriors for the next couple days until we're done. Okay, who's this one? Uh, okay, so I can play with anybody. So let's not do Zelda. <laughs> I, I love her personification in this one. She's a great character. Flip side. Or, great character, great personality? I don't know. 
I just I like uh I like Breath of the Wild Zelda and I like uh Skyward Sword Zelda. But yeah, her combat style is just it's too awkward. There's not very there's not very good flow, and maybe I just need to unlock a lot more combos to really get it to sing. But as it stands, half the time I press like Y Y X and I just either nothing happens or something happens really slowly. And I think that's one of the reasons why I like Daruk so much. Is you do like Y Y X and just shit explodes in front of you and he's just moshing everybody in the immediate surrounding. And you you know what his general hit radius is. Oh, get to the target location before before you freeze. Full impact. Okay, let's see if I can. Other thing I really like about Daruk, his bomb actually uh, triggers the, the weak point it is done. hits on enemies, which is really goofy strong. Okay. Frustratingly, I actually have to kill these guys. Not the Octoroks, just the blue Lizelfos. It's it before I freeze, but I think I'm fine. I need 10, 10 blue Lizelfos tails, so I should probably be somewhat thorough. Ow, jerks. Is she a technical character and just requires a lot of learning? May. Uh, yeah, kinda? Full impact! Okay. Welcome to my good graces, Mifa. Holy shit. That was some Daruk levels of... Just wailing on enemies. That is a really good weak point smash. I failed on the whole before you freeze situation, but that's okay. We and they explode again. But yeah, is Zelda a more technical character? And it will just take a while to learn her ins and outs. Kinda. She is a more technical character, I will grant that, but I think even beyond that though, she's, I think she is designed more strangely. Awkward angling, but that's fine. I cannot go. Okay. There we go. It does an okay amount of damage.
Got him. more of this for a reason. We might as well use it. Because I'm not going to get my... I'm not going to get my special. Nope, that missed. I wonder if you can actually just fight this guy largely by staying behind him. The answer is maybe, but the camera angle does not get... Oh, that's frustrating. The camera angle is not kind when fighting a line near a wall. Damn. So you'll stick around until Wander catches up to where you are, so you can avoid spoiling yourself. Well, mildly you're in luck, because I'm... I'm not actually going to be going for too much longer. I've been I've been streaming for six hours and having a great time with it. This game is fantastic. Uh, but I should not over overdo myself. So what I'm trying to do is get all my uh, side quests done real quick. And then we will come back to more of this tomorrow. Okay. And I do this one. Volcano. Sure. I'm limited. That's not a problem. We. I played for a stretch of six hours. Yeah, I'm a little slower, and I'm also very thorough about going for every side objective. I'm not actually sure if I'm going to keep up with it for... The whole series, but, or not the whole series, the whole game, but I'm having enough fun that I'd be perfectly fine focusing on side missions. Across the volcano. Timed mission. Yeah, it's about everything I'd expect. There we go. Anybody else new? Full impact. There we go. Hello, Mobbin. <laughs> I got him. You won't. Full impact. Okay, can I? There we go. Now I can lock onto him. It is done. And we're good. I don't actually know if I have to pick those things up. There we go. Goodbye, Keys. Full impact. Get out of here, shoes. Ow. Yeah, the problem is we do not have hyper clap in here. Wait, did I break the cave? You can do that? It is done. Huh. That's a new one. 
Okay, was there anything else? Nope. That looks like it was it. Uh, oh, shit. Did I use this? Damn. Kind of pointless, but big box. It's even f funnier on two-player mode. If the second player breaks a box or kills something that drops some materials, the materials will fly over to them, over to the first player if they don't touch them. Worth a try, like so. Okay. I was hoping to use that to hit the big fire moblin, but I guess I just killed a bunch of keys with it. Is what it is. I'm not locked onto him. That's a fun discovery. He is quite dead. <laughs> There's, if you don't have to keep hitting him. We... This also reinforces my mild desire to have been able to play as actually the other heroes in Breath of the Wild as well. I realized that that game was a lot tighter. And so being able to play as like Daruk or Mifa or anything would not have been... really that good, but like, it would have been cool. Like, bombs? Goodbye, tower. Did you have any- do you have anything cool for me? Nope. Take that. Her charge attack's pretty good. Oh. Okay, so I should be capable of, like, wailing on his special here. Or on his weak point. That... That crazy water spat that I've been... Or that I've got is just... Incredible for hitting it. There we go. That does some damage to him. Oh, it burns. It does burn. It is done. And there we go. <laughs> This is just a good game. I was saying this earlier, but like, and this year has been good for games, especially this fall. Usually, usually I feel kind of lost in directionless. Oh shit, Creeper World 4 comes out in a couple of days. I know, I know that's another one that I'm really looking forward to. Good year for games, man. Feels like every year is, gets better and better, but I, I guess that kind of makes sense. Standards rise, techniques improve. The indie game market just gets better and better. Sure, there's a lot more fluff to get through, but nah, it's fine. Okay. We have another combat mission. I'm probably going to leave them at this point. Uh, leave this for tomorrow. Oh, that's a, that's a daily drills anyway. I think it's still worth it to do those, but let's, uh, let's do these special missions first. And then I'll come back tomorrow for combat, because I'm starting to... I'm starting to hit my limit on uh, button mashing for the day. The demo, for, demo of Creeper World 4 is good. It is. It's going to take a lot of getting used to, but I'm really looking forward to the full game. Plus, you know, user-generated maps and some other things.
Yeah, good luck. I had trouble with the Divine Beast aiming controls. I'm okay with it. Ah, you're using motion controls. Yeah, I turned those off. I hate motion controls. Oh, look at that. They're trying to shoot at me. You can't get rid of that thing. Okay. Oh, that didn't work. Hell yeah, counterattack. It feels like the counterattacks are kind of the the best way to finish off the uh, the rock boys. Because they're just a little they're a little durable otherwise. Whoops, I think I missed. Nah, I got some... I got some bad boys with that one. Yeah, just right stick for aim. Might have to try that. It's pretty... It's pretty easy to control. If you're just doing right stick, yeah. I can see the motion controls maybe being worth it. But, like, from my perspective, I bet it works better if you're using, uh... uh let's see. I bet the motion controls work a lot better if you're using, uh, like, the small Joy-Cons as opposed to the Pro Controller. I have not been able to do motion controls on the Pro Controller without it feeling really weird and strange. Enough of that, you. I don't take damage while I'm doing super lasers. Okay, that pretty much wipes the floor with them. Hell yeah. I don't even know who was left. We pretty much left no survivors in that last couple of salvos. Which works amazingly well. There we go. Yeah, I don't even take damage if I'm in the middle of a counterattack. Nope, too late. Nope. I mean, I could shoot at them. Probably gonna get hit for this. Maybe. Am I aiming with the... Oh. Nope. I know. This just ain't working for me. We're gonna go with plan B. Go say hi. There we go. I like plan B. Yeah, the counterattack mostly works, but sometimes it just, like, does not want to grab the rocks no matter what. So instead, we just don't have to worry about it. I find you have to counter a lot earlier than you'd think. It depends. I, I find the terrain sometimes just gets in the way, is the big issue that I run into with it, where it's just like, hey, I can't counter anything no matter what, no matter my timing. We... 
Yeah, let's just finish these off. I wonder if they just didn't have time or budget or... the design shops to make the other two. Because I really wanted to do bombing runs with the bird or... Gosh, what was the other one? A camel? It felt like the camel was the biggest among them, so that might that one might have been really awkward. Flip side, it would actually be really cool to have a couple of battle maps that are just on the divine beasts. Right. Our next bird mission is bird. Got it. Well, I missed. I screwed that one up. There we go. Okay, so maybe you do actually get to do... Well, I guess, I guess you do get to do the, the Divine Beasts. Okay, let's just leave some of these boyos. Please stop shooting at me. Luckily, you can just kind of stun lock them. And leave no survivors. Bye. Oh, what? We're you using that ridge there for some reason? Not anymore, you ain't. Boyos all over the place still. Okay. I see two more Lynels over there, but that I don't think they can hit me. No, actually they might honestly be able to. They're arcing their shots over. That's rude. And that guy's inside of a rock. Rude. Get out of here. Get out of here and die horribly. Bam. Let me cut this one close. Nah. I'll be fine. Okay, there we go. Now we got a good lineup. And we're getting right about in position. Oh, time's gonna run out. Is that what got me? I didn't even realize there were a time there was a time limit on this one. Right. Well, try that again real quick. Okay, so this is going to hurt more. Which is the big issue. Okay.
I'm just trying to trying to kill the Lionels here. Not the easiest. Looks like Intercept is actually working really well at just keeping the arrows off of me. Okay. Wow. Frame rate did not like that one. I see. So Intercept uses the exact same uh it uses the the meter for for or for icicle barrage. and line this one up. This is probably fine. I'm gonna have to tank some hits here. I was really hoping the super space laser would actually take out more of these guys. Well. There we go. Lasers are plenty. <laughs> Got it. Whew. Yeah, I, I don't like this one as much as the other one. The other one being able to counter is huge. And uh, also the golems are a lot easier to fight because you can counter them to insta get them. The Lynels take, uh, they take some extra hits. Yeah, I hope they patch the like optimize the frame rate and the special effects a little bit just to get them to be a little slicker. I'm mostly fine with the bad frame rate just because like I can suspend my my grumpage in favor of hell yeah. Uh well, I guess really yeah, in favor of just the hell yeah. But by the same measure it would be like nice to see them fix it up anyway. So wants me to do that one. I guess if I do this mission real quick, I might get the mushrooms that I'm looking for. Uh, do I want to do it? I mean, it's going to be an absolute cakewalk. It will be my honor. And we want input for this one. Onward. Let's just do this real quick. Okay. Yeah, let's, let's go finish this off, grab the last of the materials, and then march ever onward. Actually, no. No, we'll go to bed. Then we'll, then we'll continue march, marching ever onward uh, tomorrow. I was just looking at these guys, thinking of their, their slow procession. I, I know there's 18 playable characters. We have technically eight of them currently. So yeah, we got 10 more. I bet by the end of this, the entire the entire screen is just covered in who you can play as. Next, it's time. Witness. It's over. Magnesis. All oh, right. I forgot. Here Her Magnesis is stupid.
capture the outpost. Yeah, I don't... I don't necessarily know where I have to look if I want to get the, uh, the mushrooms I'm looking for. Or whatever the heck they're supposed to be. Nope, nothing in here. Yeah, I, for I forgot with Magnesis. her. You don't actually have to absorb Here it goes. elements from... Or you don't have to do the absorb. You can actually just do a heavy attack. Hmm. Makes it a lot easier to get the shadow clones. Magnesis. Hello. Yeah, this is... This is the character for that Magnesis fight. Holy shit. I guess we'll just do this one. I am. I'll do this one. Okay. I did the wrong thing. And that is okay. Okay, go defeat Mobbin. Is this the right way? No. We want to go this way. There's three doors in this area and it throws me off every time. This time you're not you're not going to fool me. Holy shit! I forgot. She's incredible for melting. She's incredible for Magnesis. Melting, uh, stun bar off of enemies. Well, he did. That was quick. Did we get what we needed? Hell if I know. Hope so. And the answer is... Oh, we get some money. Get some weapons. Get some more weapons. Not what I was looking for. Maybe I can buy this stuff later. I don't know. I don't care too much about, like, getting every side quest immediately, especially if the merchants sell the materials I'm looking for soon enough. Yeah, so we're missing... We're missing whatever that purple fruit is. So yeah, hopefully, maybe as we go further, we'll be able to get, uh... We'll be able to get a merchant that sells exactly what I'm looking for. But for now, at least, I have not saved in, like, a very long time. And I probably should. <laughs>